NASA has blazed a trail for all of humankind. We have done really incredible ambitious missions, uh, robotic missions that make new scientific discoveries and essentially rewrite textbooks every year on a regular basis. The computer that was used during the Apollo era, the Apollo guidance computer, allowed for 85,000 instructions per second. Our high-performance spaceflight computing platform will allow for 15 billion instructions per second. So a faster computer. We gotta try to get there faster, if possible, with new rocket technology. We carry more payload than any other rocket. NASA is working on this larger rocket to carry what we need to build platforms to do our deep space journeys. So onto Mars, or back to the moon, or around the moon, which is part of our initial set of missions. We look at technologies that will get us there, land us there, and once we get there, we have to be able to explore. Uh, there are other technologies we're looking at uh, that would allow you to kind of suit up immediately and go straight out the door, which is something that our astronauts right now would love to do. You know, we've been taking the lessons we've learned from the current white suit and we've built lots of other suits to test lots of other capabilities. It's been a real heritage of learning and development. We proactively work with companies to understand their challenges and opportunities and see how our innovative ideas and technologies can help them meet those so they can grow their businesses, create new jobs. So when you think about 60 years of NASA's history, how it has benefited all of humanity and, and changed the human condition on Earth, the way we communicate, the way we navigate, the way we produce food, the way we produce energy, the way we do disaster relief, the way we predict weather, the way we understand climate. We are all dependent on space for our everyday lives. All of these capabilities, all of these technologies, all of these things that have improved human life on Earth are available because of a trail that was blazed by NASA. And I think that's really what we do. Subscribe for more of NASA's 60th anniversary.